What's going on YouTube? Little update on the F-150. Well, big update. As you can tell, it looks completely different. Just finished it up. Full color match grill. We went ahead and did bumpers, grill. Now on this gray spot right here on the XLTs, all this is like gray metallic. Went ahead and did a satin black to match the wheels. Did the mirror caps, fender emblems. Went ahead and went with a RTR wheels, 18 up front. And then we are running a drag pack with the 17 in the rear. Had a lot of trouble figuring out what's the right tire size for the front. That way it looks good for the back tire. This is about three quarters of an inch smaller. This is an 18. Tire size is right at 255, 55, 18. And these tires, they stick. They have a nice little flush. They stick out just in the air, but not, not much. The front, I don't think I can get down in here, but it does have the IEC coilovers. See right there. Upper control arms. Color match. Of course, all the mirror caps were smooth. Door handles, color match. And then, just to give you a little shot right here, traction bars, IEC, of course, performance suspension. It's set at a little lower than three in the front, five in the rear. Ran a 315.55, Mickey Thompson. Ran that one just because, again, everything that I see, a lot of these Fords, People are putting like these real small 305, 45s. I just think it doesn't look right. This one fills in the wheel well a lot nicer. Rear bumper was painted. Now, if you're in the Dallas-Fort Worth area, a guy named Javier, um, he's got an IC10, had a really nice white regal. He's the one that did all my color match. Did a really good job on it. Took all the sensors, part all the emblem. This piece was all smooth, textured as well. So it was all smooth down. That color match just gives it that cleaner look. Of course, of course with another black accent, which it looks nicer. You know, this was all black, so it just kind of dipped down for no reason. I think when you look at it, it looks a little bit more aesthetically pleasing. Um, right here, just give you a shot down. Those 315s do stick out a little bit, but I think it gives a nice look. And then come down here. Of course, it's got the adjustable shocks in the rear, traction bars, full bolt-on setup. Give you a couple angles. The truck came out really, really good. There's nine and eight difference on the color match. Other than that, drop a comment, tell me what you think about it. Drives really nice with the suspension. No more body roll. Of course, it is a performance suspension, so it's coilovers up front, adjustables in the rear. And uh, it does, you know, ride a little stiff, but of course, that's what it's for. Gonna be happier than when the truck came out. Other than that, please subscribe. Of course, tell me what you think on any other modifications that we should do. Thank you.